how are you? Tough week last week. How's everyone reacted to that? Um, yeah, um, I think everyone's everyone's tried to be um, as upbeat as they can, and um, looking forward to, to putting it right on, on Saturday. Have you put your finger on kind of what went wrong? Because it was such an un Huddersfield Town performance. Yeah, no. Um, listen, we've just going to always be games like that, and um, that's football. Uh, but I don't think it matters what team you are. Um, you know, sometimes then things happen. Um, but you know, we will put that behind us now and, and move on to, to Saturday. And before we talk about Saturday, what about your season overall? How much your view on it both personally and the team? Um, yeah, personally, um, I'm, I'm quite happy with it. Um, obviously, there's, there's bits that could have been better and, and things that I'm uh, hoping to, to improve on next season. Um, and as a team, you know, I think I think it's going to be exciting for next season. Um, I think we we show glimpses of, of what we can do. Um, but you know, there's, there's a lot of things also that we need to work on as well. You said personally, there's things you want to improve on. What will be your big targets over the summer and going into next season? Um, I think uh, overall game and, and hope that I'd like to score some more goals ne- next season. Um, I was a bit disappointed uh, with, my, with my goals return this, this season. Um, but I was, I was pleased with my assists. Um, something that I wanted to work on from last season. Uh, so thank you, I've, I've done that. And you have been won the award for most assists this season. And again, how pleased were you that that part of the game has remained so strong going into what's the second difficult season? Um, yeah, you know, uh, as I said, it's, it's something that I, I want to work on, um, and it's something that I, I hopefully, you know, I, I want to keep a, a good level for next season as well, and you know, hopefully chip in with a, a few more goals. You used to see him on the wing, but you can't play that central in staff that way at Bristol City. How do you find that? How different are the two roles? Uh, yeah, they're, they're slightly different, but I think we, we rotate quite a lot anyway. Um, so I, you know, I don't think it matters if in the, the three areas, but the three positions behind the striker. Um, you know, we all had to rotate, and I think we can all play them them roles. And if you're needing to go up front again with Naki not being available this weekend, uh, how would you feel about that? Yeah, and I've, I've, I've um, you know I've looked forward to, to doing that. It's uh, a position that I used to play when I was uh, in the youth team back at, at Man City. Um, so yeah, that, that won't be a problem for me. So over the season, what's your favourite moment, standout moment? Uh, I think it would have to be the, the win at Leeds. Um, obviously it's a, a massive game for us and, and this for them as well. Uh, you know, it's the, the, the first game that we that we look for on the fixture list and obviously being uh, losing the game here at home, we, we get to put it right and, and that's what we did. As you mentioned, you scored in that game, so we'll, we'll bring that up. But how important was that moment for you and the team? Because I think you haven't won in a few games, Leeds have won quite a few, and you were worrying about the relegations, and that kind of seemed to make everyone believe again and set the standards. How much of a landmark do you think that game was? Um, yeah, I think it was, but I think we, we always believed that, that we, were, we were good enough to stay in the league, and I think we always believed we were good enough to beat Leeds. Um, you know, I think they They've put on, um, you know, they had a, a good run just before they played us, um, but you know, I don't think that means anything in this league, uh, and especially in derbies as well. You know, I think and on on any given day, any team can can beat anyone. It's going to be um, a dramatic season finish at the top of the table. And how would you follow it? Who would you be tipping for the second automatic promotion spot? Uh, I think it's a toss of a coin. Uh, I don't think you could could uh, you know pick pick a team. Um, should be a good game between between Brighton and Borough, but um, yeah, could, could be either. <laughs> and uh, finally, for you, how important is it, particularly after last week, to kind of make sure you are finishing the season deservedly on a high after what's been a decent season? You, you get that done on Saturday at Brentford. Yeah, it's it's very important for us. You know, we, we want to put last week, um, we want to put that to bed and and, and give the fans um, some entertaining football on Saturday. And, and um, you know, I think it'll be a good game, and hopefully we can. Get three points.